To counter your opponent grabbing your arm and torso, grab your opponent's hand with your free hand. Use your other hand to grab his elbow. Your opponent may still retain his grip on this hand. Use your thumb and first two fingers to press into the sides of his hand. Position your thumb between the thumb and finger bones in his hand. Position your fingers on the palm side of the finger bones in his hand. By squeezing down on these pressure points, you can loosen his grip to release his hold. Use the thumb on your other hand to squeeze the muscle over his elbow on his forearm. Row his elbow to the outside, bend his wrist back, pressing his palm to his forearm. In this hold, you can work the pressure points in his hand and elbow as you simultaneously hyperflex his wrist. In this variation, grab his hand that is restraining your arm with your free hand. Twist his wrist using your restrained arm to extend his elbow. Bring his arm over and down, twisting his palm to face the floor. Your hands are on opposite sides of your opponent's arm. Roll his arm over to press down on his elbow, keeping his arm straight. Use your thumb to press his thumb while gripping his wrist with your fingers. Twist and extend his arm simultaneously. In this variation, use your free hand to remove his hand from your torso. Place your fingers on the palm side of his wrist with your thumb on the back of his hand. Grab his elbow with your other hand. Push his elbow up as you twist his palm back, keeping his forearm extended and twisted. Bring his forearm to the floor. Hyperextend his elbow as you twist his hand to break his grip on your torso. Use your thumb to press the little finger side of his hand while gripping his wrist with your fingers. Twist and extend his arm simultaneously. In this variation, grab your opponent's hand on, on your torso. Bend your elbow to trap his wrist between your upper arm and your forearm. Twist your opponent's hands so that their palms are facing out and their little fingers are pointed up. Pinch his hand between your elbow, twisting his wrist. In this variation, use your forearm to trap your opponent's wrist against your upper arm. Locking your arm and your elbow, turn your body to bring your opponent off balance. Your forearm pins and twists his wrist. Your opponent must grab your upper arm for this technique to work. Press the little finger side of his hand to his wrist. To take your opponent down, add your free hand to press down just above his elbow to hyperextend his arm. Press his arm up with your body, keeping his wrist locked in your forearm. In this variation, lift your restrained arm up to loosen his grip, then grab his elbow and twist in and up. Grab his other hand to restrain it. Twist his elbow so that his inner arm faces up. Squeeze in with his other hand so he cannot twist out. To upset his balance, step so that he pivots around you. To counter your opponent grabbing your collar, grab his hand with both hands. 
Lean forward and sink, pressing the back of his hand towards his forearm to hyperextend his wrist. Twist to take him down. Use your thumbs to push his fingers back while your little fingers lock his wrist. Squeeze his hand in from the sides with your palms. Step back as you lean forward, using your body to help press his hand back and extend his arm. Bring the inside of his forearm to the floor. Once to secure his hand, lean, turn, and sink in one fluent motion. In this variation, grab his hand with the same hand. Use your forearm to twist his arm over. Press down on his elbow to hyperextend it. Sink your body down to take him down. Twist his wrist so his fingers and his elbow point up. In this variation, twist his arm back while pulling his shoulder forward. Sweep his foot to take him down. With your opposite hand, twist his wrist so his thumb points down and his fingers point to the side. With your other hand, grab the back of his upper arm, keeping his elbow extended. Press his wrist back as you pull his upper arm forward and down. Simultaneously, sweep his leg. After your opponent falls, pivot to follow him while keeping hold of his arm. In this variation, grab his hand with your same hand and his elbow with your other hand. Twist his arm so that his thumb points down and his palm faces out. Pivot to bring him off balance. Bring his forearm to the floor to take him down. When your opponent follows the collar grab with a punch, grab his punch at his wrist and elbow. Twist his wrist so that his elbow faces up. Press down on his elbow to hyperextend it. To take him down, cross his arms, pressing down with his extended arm. By restraining his fist and manipulating his elbow, you can control his entire arm. His body will follow. To counter your opponent grabbing your collar with both hands, grab his wrist from above and below, with your right hand to his right wrist and your left hand to his left wrist. Twist his arms to cross his elbows. By continuing to twist his arms around each other, you can lock his upper body and take him down. Grab your opponent with your arms coiled so that you can have the advantage to twist his arms. In this variation, step in and press your shoulder against your opponent as you twist his arms. This locks his body by pinning his shoulder in opposition to his twisted arms. Using the crook of your opponent's elbow, hyperextend his other arm. His folded arm is trapped by your shoulder and your grip. By placing your shoulder beneath your opponent's shoulder while pulling on his twisted arms, you can pin him by extending his body over your shoulder.
To place your shoulder correctly, sink your stance instead of leaning your body. Pull his folded arm down while hyperextending his other arm and keeping your shoulder up.